swingers into the penalty area. It's a bit of a swirling breeze out there, and this one will go to the back post, and the keeper's been caught out, and it's Matthew Sanders who heads home. The Colonel hits the back of the net, and after 19 minutes from one of their very first over hit, but he'll just get there in time. Morton, can he find Walter at the back post? It's 1-1, South Hobart back on terms here. Alex Walter tapping home, but that goal was all about Nick Morton. Put it on a plan up for his winger there. No one on the deck, so South Hobart with the throw in. Adam Gorry works it to Hamlet. He's got Van Dorn in support. Turns centrally instead. It's Ben Hamlet! Oh, what a solo goal from Benjamin Hamlet. Hammer time here at North Hobart Oval. It's two goals to one. And a fine piece of work in the... This one falls out in front of DeSouza. Bends it, it's over the head of Walsh. That's a great ball to Whiskey Van Dorn. Can you get onto his right? He goes with the left. He scores. It's Whiskey Van Dorn. The Canadian makes it 3-1 with a thunderous hit. Works it forward for Sanders. Slides it through. This is a great chance to pull one back. It's shot. And it's going to cross the line. It's 3-2. And it's Nicky Edwards who's pulled it back for the Zebras. And early struck himself out. He can't. Jaden Hayes pounce. He's got Riley Dillon there in support. Jaden Hay cuts it back for Dillon. And just like that, the Zebras are level. Riley Dillon with a tap in. Jaden Hay robbing Nick Morton. Dillon chips it over the top. It's Matty Sanders. He's lobbed the keeper. Matthew Sanders with a touch of class. And the Hobart Zebras with a 4-3 lead. They have stopped. And the Morthog goes to the back post and it's volleyed home and South Hobart strike now. And is it Loic Ferral who's got the final touch? 100%. And they work it out to the right hand side where Gorry's got room to work into. They do so now. He punches in towards Morton. Hamlet! 5 4 South Hobart. Benny Hamlet pounces and prods home. What could be a match winner? Still plenty of time left.